So you have a second season of the Lord of the Rings colon the Rings of Power for me? Colon. Yes, sir, I do. Fans love when we slap our colons onto their favorite franchises. Yes, <laughs> they do. The cultural impact that the first slap. season had is incalculable. Oh, really? Yeah, well, in the sense that we don't have any data of any impact, <laughs> but it's still pretty cool. <laughs> that is pretty cool. So tell me about the second <laughs> season. What's going okay. on with everybody? Oh, well, we're going to start off with some Sauron backstory, <sighs> right? Turns out he was betrayed and killed by Adar uh -huh. and some orcs, but then eventually he became the Venom symbiote. So he ended up being okay. <laughs> what? Yeah, he tumbled around as Venom for a little bit before landing on his final form of scraggly but handsome five o'clock shadow man. Pretty cool that Here he can go. customize his character like that. Right? So anyway, then he got into a shipwreck like, just like and a had game. a little meet cute with Galadriel in the middle of the ocean. So what's going on now that she knows that he's Sauron? Well, she thinks they should use the <laughs> rings forged like in the first season to fight him, and the High King agrees. Err, uh, kings, they get higher tight. That's not, <laughs> never mind. So Elrond, he thinks not that so oh, he takes tight. things and jumps up a big old waterfall is he okay, okay. obviously yes yeah, so he goes to see this old Clearly. wise elf to help him we'll and the elf is like you know we should totally use these rings ah so what did what did what did that accomplish <laughs> we filled up some screen time and we're closer to our content targets on amazon prime video <laughs> wow 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 yeah, super exciting stuff so then galadriel more gets a ring how it rolls to her feet and so she's like well that's i'm gonna that's mine now <laughs> so what about the other that's characters it. like tall wizard who is definitely Definitely not Gandalf. Oh, Definitely. We're find out at the end of the season that he is Gandalf. What? Yeah, and that's going to allow us to spend this entire season doing yep. what every good prequel does. <laughs> Revealing how he got his name and accessories. <laughs> exactly. So he figures he needs a staff and he's going to help those non-hobbit hobbits and he's going to get one. Amazing. Now one of those non-hobbit hobbits is going to kiss a boy on the mouth. <laughs> Why? I don't know, but that's in here. Oh, Why? Okay. And eventually these other little folks that he helps out are going to be like, well, thanks a lot, Grandalf. And he's gonna be like Grandalf, Grandal, <laughs> Grand, Grand, Grand. My name's gonna be Gandalf, isn't it? Oh, it comes oh from God. mispronouncing an incorrect statement. That's kind of neat. <laughs> that's right, sir. Tom Bombadil a confirms bit? it. A Tom bit? Bombadil. Yeah, he's in this. He's, he's in like, this. Hey, that's I'm right. Your quest guide or something. I don't know. And how does Gandalf get the staff exactly? <laughs> I don't he know. He freaking finds it. But Tom Bombadil <laughs> explains it's like in the books, you know, it's like a wand chooses the wizard type of thing. Well, that's from the wrong. That's from Harry Potter. <laughs> uh, whoops. Whoopsie. Well, we'll do it anyway. So what's going on with the other characters? What? What's going on with Isildur? Well, he's found by a horse and escapes Isildur. some spiders and falls in love with a girl who's going to leave him, but then isn't, and then he leaves her. Because hey. that's right. In the, in the in season one, did they try to act like he died? Like they try to like do a whole thing like he like he died? Clearly no. But like, why even like? <sighs> I don't know. Listen, that sounds like things that are definitely going to happen. They are. And what about Elrondir? <laughs> oh, well, I don't really know what to do Why with them. Why does it say the like He's going to pop out once in a while to help out in ways that involve him doing lots of flips. Very cool. <laughs> but at a certain point, he's going to get fatally stabbed on the battlefield. Oh, no. It's going to be tough to survive a fatal stab wound. Actually, it's going to be super easy. Barely an inconvenience. <laughs> oh, really? Yeah, see, the next time we see him, he's totally fine, and we never mention what happened or mention it at all again. <laughs> so how do we survive? By being totally fine the next time we see him. That's I guess it. that makes sense. That answers it. I don't I don't know. I blind queen lady see him. I guess that makes sense. Maybe. I don't I don't know. I blind queen lady in Looking Numenor. at the papers. She got blinded by a volcano in the last season. Oh, well, she oh loses God. control of Numenor after a big She's got her eyesight back. The guy with drastic eyebrows should be in charge. Right? <laughs> and then she regains power after a giant sea worm decides that she should be in charge. Um, Is their political system just based on whatever giant animal they come across? <laughs> Mostly yes, but then she gets accused of colluding with Sauron, what? so she's out again. Dang, well, I hope she comes across, uh, you know, a giant chipmunk or something. <laughs> that, that might something. help. And then there's also stuff going on with those dwarves. Uh, what's going on with those little dudes? That was the most boring part for me. Ring, and that drives him mad with greed and power. Uh-oh, powerful short king. So he starts digging like crazy and accidentally comes across the Balrog. Ah, what does he okay. do? He Leroy Jenkins is it and sacrifices himself, <laughs> so his son and all the other dwarves go up and have a nice little Leroy. few. Roy Are they not Jenkins. concerned about the giant fire monster they found in the basement? Seemingly not. And what is Sauron up to now that he's been found out? <laughs> well, he heads back to see that elf Celebrimbor to make more uh, rings. Did nobody okay. tell that guy about the situation? No, they tried once and then didn't follow up on I it. Oh, well, they, they tried. So now Sauron pretends to be the Lord of the Gifts, which means he's got a totally different hairstyle. Oh, oh my sick, God. new skin. But he's got another trick up his sleeve. Oh, yeah? Yeah, see, he convinces Adar and the orcs to attack the city. How come? Ah, because then he could tell Celebrimbor... I'll stop them from attacking the city only if you finish making uh -huh. these rings. Oh, did he stop making the rings? Yeah, well, he stopped because the freaking city was under attack. So, <laughs> so 
he would have just kept going if Sauron hadn't planned that attack. <laughs> <laughs> well, <laughs> well, figure it out. Figure it out. <laughs> well, 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 listen, if you want to see some orc warfare, well, good. That's a, this week, they would get better that way with this. Very cool. Yeah, they're going to do some freaking cool stuff like destroy a mountain so he wants it to see. crumbles down and dams a river, which means they can walk right across. Hey, listen, I don't think that's how rivers or mountains work, but it's like I told my friend before he fell into a hole to his death. Oh, well. Then there's also going to be a fight scene between Sauron oh, and well. Galadriel because they're in uh, love, I guess. I don't care. And how does that go? Well, I don't Gonna get seriously stabbed and throw herself off a cliff to get oh out of there. Well, she can't die. She's in the Lord of the Rings movie. That's right. Yeah, and so that's why. No, she doesn't. She's all right. Well, great. And you know, in fact, anyone She's that all we right. know from the Lord of the Rings movies that's in this show will not be dying in Thank this you. show. So that's, exactly. Yeah, I guess that'll be exciting to watch, even though we know they're not in any danger. Right. Because it's like, well, what? What if they have a bad day? They wouldn't <laughs> like that. Yeah, that would suck for them. What probably. if? Probably. So then all the main elf characters <laughs> pose dramatically, and okay. we're done. Well. It's Sounds like a second season. Another one, number two. Yeah, I mean, let's hope people, well, it sounds like a second season. Another one, number two. Yeah, I mean, let's hope people like it so we can keep making more. Oh, God. Well, that doesn't really matter. We spent well over a billion oh, on this. We're, God. we're in this now. Right? <laughs> we're in this now. To a five season plan? No, no. Is it better to just binge it? Like... Like was did the week to week was that good or or is this one where it's like hey actually if you binge it it's better it still kind of sucks there's some things you'll like but if you binge it it's 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 better because the whole week to week thing did they do that with this I want I feel like they did do week to week with this and even with season one I was just like I don't even care but I'm gonna watch it because it's Lord of the Rings but this one I was like I'm good I I'm I'm good it's better to enjoy the movies and forget the series exists yeah that's what that's kind of where I'm at. Even though they're doing another movie, I'm a little bit worried. Uh, but <laughs> yeah, the War for Rohirrim that that looks kind of cool. Uh, but I'm I'm a little worried for like the next movie. I'm I'm, I'm just being straight up. Because um, isn't it set like after everything, like after Return of the King, or are they going further back and showing us some pre stuff? Um, yeah, I don't know. Oh, cool. This is really unnecessary <laughs> as far as the anime Lord of the Rings. That that's the only part of it where I was like, this is weird. But like what? There's an old like Lord of the Rings cartoon like that's got that old timey like animation. Uh, I thought they were doing something like that. I didn't know it was going to be an anime. So that was interesting. But this I, I'll watch it at some point. I'm not in a rush at all, but I will watch it at some point. Or 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 <laughs> read the books. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, yes. Also true. What's the one book they, they, they always refer to the, the Cimmerillion, the, is that what it's called? Cimmerillion? Is it that they, they don't have full rights to that? And that's why this show is like, kind of, they're doing their own thing in, in some ways. Cause they don't have the full rights to that. Did I hear something about that? I thought I did. Um, but you know, it's where we're at now. Uh, <laughs> live stream your reactions to the books. <laughs> <laughs> and that's why I hear it. Summer really is always is the best book. That's why I always hear. Like that's one that people always talk about when they bring it up. Um, they have the right to the appendices of L O T R. Hmm. Should I read the book li live stream me reading the book aloud? <laughs> That'd be funny. That would get no views, but you know, it's all good. Uh, how does that go? Also, like if you were to like read a book on a live stream or put out a video of you reading a book, isn't there something around that, like almost similar to like, you know, if you were to watch a movie or watch a TV show straight through, which you can't do on YouTube anyway, but are books similar? I wonder, I wonder, just a thought. I've always thought about it, but this, this was so good. I just love that. I don't care. I want him to bring that back a little more often because some of these like really warrant it. Um, so I hope that he brings that back a little bit more, but this was still, this was hilarious. 